guys, it's me, My Reborns, and I am back with another video. So today is Saturday, February 5th, and it's currently 5.20 p.m. I think this is my first video for February. My first video that I posted in February, I'm not sure, but my first video I recorded in February, this is it right here. So happy February to all of you guys and it is black history month so happy black history month and so anywho we have another blanket reveal i know another baby so this is a baby that i painted and completed um a little bit ago like a couple minutes ago but this baby isn't um fully done i just wanted to get on here to show you guys the baby so um yeah but the baby should be completed by tomorrow so I decided to wrap the baby up in the blanket, you know, do something cute. Um, sometimes I would do like fake box openings to reveal a baby I painted or just a regular blanket reveal. So we're just going to do a regular blanket reveal. I'm so excited to show you guys this baby. Um, but yeah, I'll tell you guys everything, like why the baby isn't complete. But the baby is varnished. Here are the leggies. There's a little scratch right there. On the knee, cause this is a really big baby, or long, I should say. It's a very long baby. This baby does not even fit on the boppy. <laughs> and then uh, we have this leg. Here are the feet. Oh, I don't think I showed you guys the feet. Here are the feet. Look at the little feetsies. We're going to move on to the hands. Yes, this baby doesn't have anything to wear. We're going to get the baby dressed. My camera's dying. <gasps> okay, give me a second, guys. All right, I am back. So here are the baby arms and hands. And of course, I'll move you guys closer at the end of this video. Well, I'll probably take you guys off the tripod once I reveal the baby's face. Are you guys ready? One, two, three. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys can't. You guys can't see. Let me bring the tripod up. There we go. There's the baby. This is the kid sweet pea by Laura Lee Eagles, who is one of my favorite, one of my favorite um, sculptors, Laura Lee Eagles. I love her. Her work is amazing. This is an older kit, Sweet Pea Asleep. You can find this kit on Bountiful Baby. Um, there is an awake version. I just decided to not paint twins. But um, yeah, I like the Sweet Pea Asleep version more than I like the awake, so I decided to get this baby. So let me just start by saying this is a budget baby. Woohoo! I decided to paint a budget baby and this was the kit that I was going for to paint a budget baby with. So it's not that many details of course. It does have some flaws and it's not perfect. However, the price does reflect in that. I'm still debating on if I want to have the same price as Scarlet um, or just a little bit more but not too much. So he'll, he'll be around that price, around Scarlet's price. And so... I am going to dress him in a boy outfit. You guys know usually I do one boy outfit, one girl outfit. But I really love this baby as a boy. So I'm just going to dress this baby in a boy outfit instead of a girl one. Um, however, if you are interested in seeing this baby as a girl. And you are wanting to purchase this baby. But you want to see the baby as a girl. You can DM me on Instagram. And I'll put this baby in some girl clothes. Or on. Uh, you can email me. Okay, let me take you guys down. So here are the baby's legs and details. And when I change the baby, I'll tell you guys what else that I'm going to be doing. That's like why the baby isn't completed. It has a little cute scratch on the knee. I actually like doing scratches. This baby has a cute birthmark right here. Right here where my hand is or my finger. It has a cute birthmark. Here are the toesies. Bottom of the feet. It's not really showing up how it actually is, but it's showing up a little bit. I have to take photos of this baby bottom of the feet i did give this baby some nails because on claudia i did it i felt like claudia was too little but this baby is super big so i decided to give the baby nails it's only right here's the left hand and um arm this one's open it's like waving hi <laughs> he's waving to you all and then here's the right one and then here's the cute face it does have two scratches there's a scratch right here and then there's a scratch right here which i thought was so cute Go to guys i don't know what just happened but i hope my camera got off that just did some weird thing i don't know what happened 
Oh, my shadow's blocking. Okay. I'm gonna go see if that's saved. I'll be right back. Okay, guys. Sorry for the horrible details. <laughs> the horrible job I did at recording this baby details. But this baby is so, so cute. And so, I am gonna bring the baby down a little bit just so you guys can see his face. Maybe I can turn him to the side. Sorry, I know I'm blocking the ring light, so it got a little dark for a second. Let me see, let me see. Look at your friends, potential mom or dad. There we go, that is like perfect. So, all right. I have a size one diaper and I have a size three diaper. Let me show you guys what the baby's gonna be wearing quickly so I can get, so my battery doesn't die. Can you guys believe I can't find a battery that's charged? Um, anyways, this baby's gonna be wearing this super cute um, outfit long sleeve. This is a newborn, but look how big that is. That's like three months, it has to be. But it's Wonder Nation's newborn. It's gray, has a cute little tiger right here. The tiger ears go out. It's uh, black, white, gray, and of course orange. And then the, I don't even think those go, because isn't this like, this is definitely a different animal. This is like what? What animal is that, guys? Let me know in the comments below. But anyways, I'm still going to put them on because, I don't know, maybe it does go. I have no clue. It's still Wonder Nation. And, um, yeah. Oh, it says newborn slash zero to three months. That's weird. I didn't know it could be both. Anywho. These are the pants. They're gray, outlined in the same orange. They have cute little white strings. Um, there's another face on here. I don't think that's the tiger, but somebody else. And then, like, for the knees or, like, the low ankles, there's, like, orange patches, which I think is so cute. And then there's this little tiger hat that I'm going to put on him because he is bald. So let's get started. We're going to put the size one diapers on him. So as you guys can see, this baby body does have strings. I'm not a fan of the strings. So, um, okay, I shouldn't have started off saying that. Let me tell you guys why the baby is incomplete. Like I said, the baby is varnished, but um, the baby is not complete. So the reason for that is because this is a budget baby. So the baby does not have any hair which means the baby does not have eyebrows currently. So I can um, add hair at an additional, this looks a little snug, but I'm gonna leave it. I can add hair at an additional cost on this baby. And once that gets settled out, if they want hair, then I'll put the eyebrows on. If they don't want hair, I'll still put the eyebrows on. I'll just ask whoever purchases this baby, you know, what color hair or what color do they have in mind for the eyebrows? Probably black or brown. So that's the reason why. So this baby will have eyebrows once it goes to his new home. I would just ask, you know, do you plan on getting this baby rooted by me right now for an additional cost? If not, what color would you like me to do the eyebrows? Or if they don't want eyebrows, then that's fine as well because he does have these little eyebrow bones. So his, he still looks fine and cute without the eyebrows. Now that's the first thing, which is why he isn't fully completed yet. But I did just wanted to get on here and show you guys him for tomorrow's video, which is why I wanted to do this video right now. <laughs> but um, yeah, the next thing, um, I am waiting on my supplies to get here to go ahead and gloss him in the necessary areas. You know, his mouth needs to get glossed. I'll get into the corners of his eyes, his uh feet well his nails on his feet and his hands they also need to get glossed so nothing too major which is why again i decided to bring this baby on to you all um another thing is this baby since this baby is a budget baby this baby is not weighted with glass beads um well the baby has glass beads on his feet at the bottom of his feet and he has glass beads on um his hands and then the rest of his limbs are filled with polyfill. Again, just to keep everything cheap for you all. Hence, he is a budget baby. So that is the reason why he's not weighted. I can weigh him fully, correctly with glass beads for, again, an additional cost. But I'm trying to keep prices down. Like I said, he is a budget baby. 
So this is the only way I can make him an actual budget baby by not really giving him everything. Oh my gosh, I forgot his cute little shirt that I wanted to put on him. So yeah, you can leave him with just the glass beads in his feet and his hands or you can go ahead and let me weigh him properly. I think that might be too small anyway, so we're just going to say forget it. For an additional cost. Now, uh, back to the string situation. I personally don't like my my babies to have strings. So, once um, I reweigh this baby, I will switch out the strings for zip ties. Because I, I personally don't like the strings, so I don't want to send or make a baby that has strings for the body. But again, there's nothing wrong with the strings. I just feel more secure with the zip ties instead of the strings. So... Um, yeah, I'll switch those out later on when he's like fully completed and weighted because you guys see how he's stuffed. I don't like that. So, but it's just for the meantime, it's just to bring him on here and show you guys what he looks like and how he would look. But yeah, he's not stuffed how he is going to be stuffed when he's on his, um, this is his actual body, but like when he's weighted and stuffed properly. If that makes sense. So yeah, like I said, I'm switching out his zip ties. Um, his strings for zip ties. I'm getting tongue tied. I'm getting tongue tied. Tongue tied. See? There we go. Alright. This baby is super long. Um, not necessarily big or chunky. This is a skinny baby. This baby is 22, 23 inches. 23 inches, I really want to say. He's super big, like look at it. He's so cute though. I like his bald head. But um I he will look really really cute with rooted hair as well. But I do like his bald head. And there go the ring light guys. I'm gonna bring you guys back with the ring light. But here's his outfit. I hope my shadow wasn't blocking the ring light too much for you all. But that's him without the ring light. He's still super cute without it. He's saying hi, potential mom or dad. So before I close up this video and put the ring light, the ring light back on, and then we're gonna be done with this video. I really hope I wasn't blocking the camera when I was changing him, guys. I hope, I hope, I hope. Um, he does have three fourth limbs, as you guys saw. Same with Scarlet. Scarlet has three fourth limbs as well. The one thing I do like about three fourth limbs are the babies are super poseable, um, very poseable, easy to move, and um. That's one thing I do like. I think this hat might be a little too small. But <laughs> we're gonna still put it on him. He's definitely a hat baby. He's so cute. I'm gonna bring him back on sometime soon when he's all completed. We're gonna change him into just some bread for Valentine's Day. So we have a little while. And I'm gonna bring him back on so you guys can see him again. Get him changed for Valentine's Day. I don't have anything that's officially Valentine's Day, but we do have some red clothing that he can wear. But um, this is him. Yeah, this is definitely not newborn. <laughs> it's like zero to three. So yeah, zero to three, three month size fits him best. Just like Scarlett, I'll probably have to do like a comparison video of him and Scarlett because they are around the same size. I think Scarlett's 22 inches. And so, yeah, this is him. He's so cute. He looks so cozy, doesn't he? That's him. Again, he is a budget baby, so he's not perfect. He does have flaws. If anyone's interested in him, let me know by DMing, DMing me on Instagram or emailing me. Everything that I stated is linked in the description, by the way. Um, he also doesn't have a magnet for Patsy. Again, if you want one, just let me know how I add one. But let's see how he'll look with a Patsy. This is a Bibs Patsy. Mm, I don't really like that bibs on him. But he'll probably look cute in like a ma'am or a regular pacifier. Not the too fancy smancy. So yeah, that's the new baby I completed. So excited. I was so excited to finish him up and show you guys. Again, I personally like this baby as a boy. It can come home as a girl. You guys know I don't care. You just have to let me know if you want boy or girl for box opening purposes. Um, I do small box openings, you know, sleeper outfit that type of jazz 
someone did contact me and ask me, you know, if I pay you, would you do like a full out box opening? Of course, the answer is always yes, yes, yes. I don't mind. I did one before. It wasn't a baby I painted, but um, for Azraya, yeah, for Azraya, when I saw her, um, I, she did a bigger box opening for additional cost. But this is him. His head is not weighted either, only stuffed, but I'll probably weigh his head free of charge. I weigh his head free of charge for you all. But he's still super floppy, even with his head not being weighted. His head is only stuffed, and he's so floppy, so if you don't want me to weigh, that's fine. Anyway, just contact me to work out the details for anyone that is interested in him so cute i love his scratches when i did those two scratches I, was, I have to have another scratch i don't know where i should have probably did one on the cheek or like the chin but something told me just to do the knee because he is an older baby so i was like i just do the knee and it came out so cute anywho this is little sweet pea asleep by laura lee egos painted by me again i can root this baby and uh yeah i can't wait to show you guys and more of him and make more videos but that is pretty much it for this video i wanted to change javen today but i'll probably change him later on um because he got some clothes that came today and there was some red in there so i can change him for valentine's day put something red on him but uh yeah also those of you who stuck around good news uh zaire was shipped today and so he should be home in a few days and I can't wait to have him back, so yay for that. Um, do I don't think I have anything else to say. Road to 3K giveaway coming soon, plus details. I'm trying to wait until I get at least halfway there to put out details, like an official video. So, give me the 3.5K, not 3.5K, 2.5K, so I can put out some details on the giveaway. Cause I know you guys are going to get excited about that. Cause I'm super excited. I'm super excited. Okay. That is really it for this video. Um, go ahead and follow me on Instagram at my underscore reborns. I am on reborns.com under Melanated Bebe's. I'll probably post him on there this weekend. Probably on a Friday. I'll post him over there. Cause he'll be completed by then. I do have a membership if anyone wants to join. Everything that I stated is linked in the description below. Right now, there are some emojis on the screen. Basically, what that does is it lets me know that you watched all the way until here, which is pretty much the end. So, thank you guys so much for watching it until here. All right, that is it. If you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below anything you want in the comments, including video requests. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also, ring that bell so you guys can always be notified when I post another video. And that's pretty much it. Let me. I should have took you guys off like I normally do because you guys have not seen him. There he is. I'm trying not to block the ring light with my hands and head. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.